In this lesson, you'll learn how to develop pop-up menus for your Android apps. To get started, let's filter the demo name column of our worksheet for pop-ups. Filter. And we get an entry in line 294. We see that the Java file name is pop-up menu 1. So let's take a look at the demo in action. Click on Views, Pop-up Menu and click on Make a Pop-up. And we see our menu, and notice that it's displayed next to the button. So pop-up menus are associated with the button or the list item that creates them. And we can click on the items to get a toast telling us which item was selected. In the Views source code, let's open pop-up menu 1. And we see in line 36, that in its set content view method, it's using the layout pop up menu one. So let's open that. And the layout XML, notice the definition of a button starting in line 20. And in line 23, there's an on click attribute defining the name of the method that will be executed when the button is clicked on pop up button click. Back in the Java code, we see the on pop-up button click method starting in line 39. So this is the code that will be executed when the button is clicked. So let's see what it does. In line 40, a pop-up menu object is instantiated. In line 41, the get menu inflator method is used to inflate the pop-up menu. And let's take a look at the pop-up menu in the menu resources folder. So in the menu folder, we see it here. Double click on pop up. And here we have the details of the menu itself with items for search, add, and edit. And you notice in edit, there's a sub menu. So if we click on edit, we see a sub menu item. We can click on that. And we also get a pop up saying that the share button has been clicked. And notice that each entry in the XML specifies an ID, an icon, and a title. Now back to the Java code. And in lines 43 and 44, a toast is made that includes a reference to the specific item clicked. It uses the getTitle method to get the name of the menu item. In a real app, it's here that you'd take actions based on the menu item clicked. And in line 51, the pop-up menu is displayed using the show method. So that's our lesson on pop-up menus. Let's move on and look at context menus in the next lesson.